morning all. Now I'm quite a big fan of these LED voltmeters and they tend to come in two flavours. Uh, the two wire, like this one, which kind of measures its own power supply and the three wire, like this one, which can measure a separate voltage to the voltage that you're using to power it. Now typically these things have a small three terminal regulator on them, you can see it on this one there, and that means that they're limited to about 30 volts because most of these regulators have an upper voltage limit of about 30 volts. And I generally write the spec onto the little uh, LED block there like that one, that one's quite good, it's uh, 2.5 volts to 30 volts that that thing will measure. Well now the postman's just been and uh, he's just brought me this and it's uh, another LED voltmeter, two wire as you can see, but this one's a bit different. The spec on this one is 5 to 120 volts DC. And this one does look a bit different. You've got, interestingly, that three pin plug where they're only using the two outer pins. And I'm just wondering if that's some sort of uh, high voltage thing to keep the two um, wires apart. There's also a three terminal device. I can't be sure whether it's regulated, but it might be with a heat sink sort of sellotaped onto it and that bends with the device. I might bend that up at some point uh, to see what that is because that's quite interesting. But anyway, I think it's time we powered this thing up. So here it is on my boost converter. Now, I've already got a voltmeter on there, but it is a three wire type. See the three wires there? So um, that one is measuring up to 100 volts. But this two wire type, be interesting to see uh, how we go with that. Let's start winding it up. Okay, let's start winding up the voltage. So, 30 volts, 40, 50. Now this thing says it goes up to 80 volts, but I know it goes a bit higher than that. So let's see what happens. And that's ticking. So that seems quite happy on 93.4 volts, which is quite amazing. I think that's really good. So after that being on 90 volts for a minute or so, Let's check the temperature. That heat sink's just mildly warm on the back, but I'm very intrigued to know what that chip is, that three terminal device is on the back of there, so I think we'll have a look. So I've bent that device up, and it's not easy to see, but it is a BU406, and uh, I've got a data sheet up for that. Let's have a look. So it's an NPN silicon transistor, quite a well specced one, a 400 volt 7 amp silicon epitaxial planar NPN transistor, so that's all it is. So there it is, that's a, a two wire uh, LED voltmeter which can measure its own supply voltage all the way from 5 volts up to supposedly 120 volts and uh, it certainly seems to be good for 95 volts so I'll just show you where I got it and it is the DC 7 volts to 120 volts mini red digital voltmeter tester 2 wire and uh, it was just £2.29 free postage and the seller is top web <laughs>